Hello, the kids of this eye, Stray Cat, the one and only, coming to you with another episode of City Skylines. All right, when we left off, we had just gotten the city into a position to be profitable, and we're going to try and keep it that way. But uh, I realized that eventually traffic's going to be a pain in the ass around this area. So, what do you mean, slope's too steep? You're allowing it earlier. Come on, there we go. Perfect. And now it is... Whoa, that is a little steep. <laughs> I've just noticed now it's a little steep. But it should kind of work out if people gun it. <laughs> okay, well, there's that anyway. Oh, that place says it has uh, not enough workers. Or at least that's what it looks like it's saying. Yeah, not enough workers. Uh, wow, it needs a lot of workers. And, uh, we're not quite in the position to be able to get them that many workers yet. But, uh, we're getting there for sure. Alright. Hmm. Looks like, uh, residential areas starting to grow out a little bit. Uh, let me... What? what? <laughs> oh, I'm still... <laughs> I'm still in the menu there. Okay, that was my bad. Yeah, it looks like it's growing out quite a bit. We'll need to expand that out for sure. So I should probably do that now while I have some money. Um, it was already out a little bit from there, right? It's 400, yep. So another 400. Yeah, perfect. And then up from here... Uh, yeah, let's have it the same distance as the other. Huh. It's not the same distance. Yeah, well, close enough. <laughs> okay, uh, we're not gonna be doing an exact science here anyway. Okay. Yeah, let's go this way with it. There we go. Another ways down here. There we go. 2,000. And another 400 here. And let's zone all of this area for residential. That should be fine. Yeah, that should be just fine. Uh, first things first. If I'm going to expand... Whoop. If I'm going to expand commercial out eventually, I should do it in this area here. Whoop. That's not how I meant to do it, but that's fine. Uh, there. And, yeah, just expand it out this way. Um, oh, that's right in the middle of the power lines. That doesn't work for me, does it? Ah, I could move it so this goes this way. Yeah, that'd work. Yeah, that'd work, I think. Maybe. Okay. Well, anyway, let's get back to zoning that residential area, huh? Okay. Uh, let's start here and move our way up to do it about there. And then have this area up here done. Uh, there. Perfect. Well, I could do this corner because I'm not going to expand back this way. But uh, the other the other corner over there, I'm going to leave open so that way I don't have to remove buildings should I need to expand outwards. Because we have a lot of room over here. We have plenty of room should we need to expand. And we definitely will. Oh, now that I think about it, I could expand out that way too. Yeah, I should definitely do that. There we go. Gotta think of the future. When that future happens, you don't want to be ill-prepared. Well, at least that's how they say it, right? <laughs> I wouldn't know. Okay. Beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful. And, uh... I'll need to have that expanding outwards as well. When I eventually start doing that for all of the expansions. It'll need to go all this way. Yeah. I'm doing pretty good. 
We're doing pretty damn good right now. Um, speaking of expansions, looks like I can start doing that with industrial. Uh, let's have it go out. There we go. Ah, ah there we go. Perfect. Ish. We'll call that good. Uh, not enough money. Okay. Well, we'll wait a little bit to complete that expansion. But it should be relatively doable. Key phrase should be. Ah, <laughs> uh, you know what? Nah, nah. I think I think we're good. Because if we're going to expand the area of the city, it'll probably be in this direction where the uh, where all the trees are, because that will give us timber for our timber industry, which we will eventually be going to. But for right now, we're doing pretty damn fine. We're zoned enough for the residential needs, and quite frankly, the industrial needs are pretty well covered, too. So, I don't know what they're complaining about. In fact, I think, I think we could raise taxes a little bit. Just for the rest of them now. Don't need to touch anyone else. Just need to do that for the rest of them. There we go. And that should increase the cash flow that we can then use to uh, expand the city a bit. But uh, it's going to take a while. <laughs> uh, it's going to take a long while because this game is a little slow sometimes. Alright. And there's a nice little info view that I can use should I need to know what's going on at all times, which uh, kind of I do. <laughs> okay, population, I'll obviously going to be all clustered over there. Um, no real crime rate right now. There's a lot of fire safety hazards, but uh, that'll be fixed eventually. Hey, we got the little hamlet. <laughs> hey, we got, well, we got considered a little hamlet anyway. Um, what do we got? We got more taxes, more loans. Uh, well, loans in general. We didn't have that before. Uh, we can do garbage services, healthcare, and education. And we got the buildings for each. Uh, not in the same order as the services, but hey, <laughs> that's fine. Uh, we definitely need to make an elementary school. That one I know we need to do. Um, then we can do the medical clinic right after that. Huh. Question is, where do I put it? Uh, I think the elementary school would be perfect right about here and then maybe have the medical clinic right oh right about here I need to build a need to build up some water and electricity for that section so and where should I put this maybe around here yeah that'll work Beautiful. It covers basically every one I need to. Alright, um... I should definitely fix that. Uh... I'm surprised it doesn't get connected automatically. Huh, oh well. Let's go from this way to over here. And then over... Here. Uh... Yeah, let's start it there and then have it up oh, I was going to have it loop over to here to reduce the amount of water that needs to be pumped because then it can just flow into the rest of the pipes oh no oh no I don't have enough money going into oh boy there we go that should keep it up 
enough. Um, this doesn't need to be all that high. I can turn that down a little bit. And have this to about... Yeah. Let's do 70%. And have this to about... 60%. Because there's a day and night cycle, it's best to, you know, have one section that's going to be getting you more money, uh, doing the bulk of the work when it comes to that, and then have the night cycle, which usually gives you less money on the whole, uh, have the load a little bit lessened. Because there's still going to be people going for education. That is a thing that is going to happen. Uh, what did I put it? I had it at 50, so let's keep that at 50 for now. And garbage collection, let's turn that down to about 65% and have it at 65% for the day because garbage will accumulate if you don't have it getting collected and that will be a pain in the ass later. Believe me. <laughs> Alright, and we're good on everything else. That should up the uh, up the power current enough that those will stop complaining about lack of power. There we go. Now let's double check that. We're exactly at eight. Okay. Beautiful. 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 Alrighty. And I will fix the water situation in a second once we get the money to you. And it shouldn't be that long. So I only need 540. I'm gonna take a swig of my coffee now. Beautiful! Beautiful! Alright. Okay. That works out beautifully. And... Once the money starts pouring in, I can focus more on the industrial section. Because that will eventually need to expand. Right now it's just barely covered, but it will need more. That much I know. Alright. Oh, again? Again with this? Okay, fine. Uh, I didn't realize that the new ones coming in would have to have that up. Okay. There we go. It always starts there for some reason. The lack of power. It always starts there. Uh, I'll eventually need to pop some more of these into place. Uh, I could pop one right over near the sewage plant. I could do that. Yeah, I could do that. Yeah, eventually. Right now, I don't have the money. I'll focus on that later. Alright. It is now daytime. And our sprawling city is taking shape. I should probably... <laughs> there we go. That's the one I wanted. And move this over here. Um... Do I wait, or do I do it now? Eh, I'll wait. See? We're bringing in more money as the daytime starts. We're already at, uh, 1100 as opposed to the eight and 900 we were at earlier. So, we usually always will bring in more money during the day. It's just a weird fact I've learned. <laughs> so... Just need to wait it out. Ah, there we go. Now we've got enough money to feasibly do this. And let's wait for a little more to uh, connect to the residential area. So that way people in the residential can come over and spend their money. Which is usually an important thing in capitalist societies. I, I actually wonder if you can convert <laughs> if you can convert the area to communism. That'd be funny. 
Just for the laughs. Just for the laughs, of course. Okay. That... My power needs are expanding rapidly. I should probably head it off at the pass and send it at 75. Just so I don't have to keep doing this over and over. There we go. Jesus. Okay. And that eventually should stop. That eventually should stop. There we go. It's starting now. <laughs> right. When I bitch, it fixes itself. Okay. We're doing pretty damn good. Better than I expected, which is... You know, my... My, my expectations were shockingly low, <laughs> to be fair. Okay. I've, I've noticed that you rarely need as much commercial area as you do for residential and industrial. So... It always helps to get more residential. Which we have plenty of residential right now. So I don't need to worry much about that for the time being. Commercial, I just want to head it off at the pass before the need starts outpacing the supply. Uh, which will be fairly soon. <laughs> okay. Let's get this road made. Ah, you don't like it. That's fine. Quadcopters becoming increasingly efficient for delivery services. Dropping packages directly at your door. Oh. Ah, how about that? Actually sounds cool. <laughs> Alrighty. Now I'm going to have the... Uh, commercial areas a little farther away from the residential... Uh, well, relatively far away, because the commercial can cause a lot of noise pollution, just for the sake of being commercial, because everything that's not residential has a uh, tendency of creating noise. Quite a lot of it, actually, <laughs> I've noticed. Uh, not as much as industrial, which is another reason why you want to keep everything away from industrial as far as it can not just the actual regular pollution uh, but the uh, <laughs> but the noise pollution as well there we go my brain had a uh, minor stroke there wasn't remembering words and how they work there we go and get in commercial and have that set up Oops, that's not what I wanted. I wanted it set up this way. Bap, there we go. And... Have it set up so this... Uh, let's do it this way. Okay, there's that. What the hell happened here? What the hell happened with this? How did this... How did this work? That's weird. Oh, shit. I forgot to... <laughs> I forgot to make a fucking landfill. That's my fault. That is my fault. That is my bad. Okay. Uh, okay. Tell you what we'll do. Tell, blah, blah, blah. Tell you what we'll do. What I will do is I will get a loan because those will help for immediate needs like this and I will make the expansion there we go uh, let's cut that short a little bit so that way I don't end up fucking with power lines there we go and have that there have this here and then circle that around. Okay, and immediately put in... Do I have... Ah! This worked out beautifully. Let's move this over as much as possible. There we go. And it works! <laughs> hey! Fuck yeah. And 
taking out the trash just became much more convenient than before. Uh, let's expand this out just a slight bit. Just a slight bit. And zone all of that area. Beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Okay. And again, what the fuck is this shit? <laughs> I've never seen this problem happen. Oh, boy. Alright, well, commercial's been expanded out enough. So that need that's steadily, rapidly rising will uh, be dealt with soon. And that should be taken care of momentarily. Alright, uh, what I should do is fix the water problem, which I know will eventually happen. Because, of course it will. Uh, have this cross over right about here. Can I make that less money? No. If anything, I can make it more money. But I don't want to do that. Okay. And have this cross over here. There we go. And have this cross over here. Uh, come on. There. Perfect. And uh, this, that section's not covered. Let me fix that. Uh, there. Ha <laughs> ha! It's not pretty, but it works. And that's all you need to have just to make it work. All right. I'm going to end this episode here for right now because I think we've got it pretty well covered. I... What's my budget for trash? Yeah, it, it should be... It should be on that. There's the trash guy. And that should eventually disappear. Eventually. Ah. Uh... Okay, well, we have another guy coming up, so that should deal with it soon. Okay, fuck it. I'm going to end the episode here for right now, because waiting on these guys will take forever. Anyway, thank you all so much for watching. Click the subscribe button if you like these videos and you want to see more. Click the like button if you like this particular video. Share and comment so we can bring more people into this community. We can talk about the games we're playing together, and I will see you all in the next episode. This has been the one and only Stray Cat, playing games and actually having our city go along pretty damn good. Better than I expected, <laughs> but that's from the pointers I've learned over the last week for you. <laughs>